Hello everyone. Today I'm gonna to talk about some relative budget card purchases, the $50 threshold and under. Um, also wanna mention a couple things before I get into that. I wanna thank Alex from Bowman53 for having me on his uh, Card Talk Live stream that he tends to do Sundays at around 8 p.m. Eastern time. And that has been such an informative live stream over the years or however long it's been going on. I, I, I was on it talking about pre-war um, and um, you know, people say that I'm humbled sometimes when they're the opposite of humbled, but I do feel sort of humbled to have been on that. Um, in part because uh, I don't feel like I'm the typical expert. I mean, I think that he's very accepting. He lets all sorts of people in there. But I don't, I'm not a, I'm not a pre-war expert. I'm like a pre-war newbie, but very excited and very interested. And I'm, and I, and I'm uh, happy that, you know, like he, he was, that he tapped that. He tapped my excitement and interest uh, over my, you know, wealth of knowledge. Um, and I just, you know... I feel like I sort of, um, I wish I prefaced that a little bit more going into it, but I think he did a good job. He, he did a good job at doing that. So anyway, enough about that. Another thing I want to mention is that, so I'm running a contest. I want to clear up a couple things about that. One is um, a lot of people have contacted me and said, I don't have a one card. Can I still do a video? And I'm going to say, yes, do a video. Try to do a video in the spirit of what I'm requesting with whatever you have. Um, if you have a one, please use it. Um, but um, anyone can do a video, um, even if you don't have a one. Another thing is my first video response was from a channel called Old Sarge Collects. And it was his first video. And it was awesome. I mean, forget that it was a VR for me. It was, it was, it was like, he just like punched through the wall. Um, so I'm going to link to him and in the spirit of, I think, Vintage Card Steve, who has been so generous in acknowledging channels. And I know Mangini has done a lot to, um, to, uh, to get the word out of new channels, you know, spread some goodwill to this guy, uh, and say, you know, check him out and sub him because, uh, he's, he's well worth it. Let's flip it. So this is an Arc Yvonne. He was a really colorful character. Uh, he's a Hall of Famer. He had a short but really strong run. Uh, this is a 1936 Wheaties panel or Wheaties cereal box back. Documenting that he was the batting champ of the National League in 1935. Such a cool card. It's oversized. You can see the size difference here. Uh, the card... And I'll show you the back. You know, it was a cereal box. I don't know. I don't even know what this would do to grading. I've not really, I have no plans on grading this at the moment. It's just, it's just so cool. Um, speaking of Alex from Bowman 53, I know he, he had the Lou Gehrig. And I think maybe that was the first time that I, I noticed these uh, cereal boxes. And since then I've been looking at, at them. And this is one of the ones I've been looking to get because I like the image a lot. And also, um, Arky Vaughn is a really interesting story. He was an interesting character. He had a strong personality. He kind of exited the game on his own terms. He didn't, he didn't, um, have a full career, um, not because he wasn't capable, but because kind of he left on his own. So anyway, under 50 bucks was super happy. I'm super happy about the way this looks. Another one for just a hair under 50 bucks is this Roy Campanella. So um, I know the, these Wheaties cards aren't for everybody, but I, I really like them. I love the orange throughout. They pop. Um, some of the artwork is really nice. This this is one of the ones that I like a lot. I'll, uh, I'll put together with his pals here. My little Wheaties run so far. Here's where we're at. I gotta say, um, I love these portraits. 
Uh, but there's something about this card that has me really psyched. Uh, it just, it just, it's just a special looking card and, and the orange pops even more here than it does in these. Um, so yeah, I, I, I'll be looking for more of these, I think. All right, everyone. Thank you very much. And I will see you next time.